is this you? I'm a shoemaker. I'm just a beginner. But I'm finding it difficult to understand how to create a neat job. I'm finding it difficult to actually create patterns. I'm also finding it difficult even to understand how to last my designs. I can't bottom properly. Everything seems to be in an improper shape. What do I do? Now I want you to know. I know you have a tutor. You have an instructor. You have actually paid somebody to do this for you. But it seems not to be giving you the best that you actually desire. Now I have opened up this particular exclusive forum for you. It's going to be on WhatsApp. And what do we do? I'll be answering your questions. You'll be having access to my exclusive videos from my YouTube channel. When I mean exclusive videos, what I what do I mean? Anytime I create a particular pattern, you have access to the PDF file and also have access to how I created the upper and how I finally finished the product as long as it is not published on my YouTube channel. You have the chance to dictate what you would like me to actually put up on my YouTube channel. This is what I am going to be doing for you this year hi everyone and you're welcome to today's talk show with odu role mojipola today i'm going to be giving us a quick review of what to expect in my the business of shoe making probably you are just watching my channel for the first time ensure that you subscribe to my channel make sure you subscribe and also press the notification bell so that each time i upload a video you will be notified so i'm going to be giving us a quick review and also i'm going to be giving us a gist about my first payment on youtube yeah yes i'm going to be giving us a gist about that so sit back i'm gonna be right back. so basically let's start with the the business of shoe making the review now i try as much as possible to actually answer a lot of frequently asked questions in this book and then one of those questions that i think before you start any business you should ensure you ask yourself is what is the goal what is the goal why do i want to do this what exactly do I want to achieve? I have find that that most times when you get yourself involved in actually a business, either you venture into it or out of passion or you got yourself ignited, probably watching my channel, for example, and you are so ignited, you are so in love, you have to come around with what goal do I want to achieve by getting myself into this? Which is which I think so many of us don't hack ourselves. What problem does this business want to solve? Those are one major things. They are the major things I try to highlight inside this book. You have to understand the major problem you want to solve. How do I go about this? I think you really need to check that book out to understand all of this. How do I channel myself and ensure that I am actually um, um, preferred my product is preferred i am i am preferred my solution to the problem is preferred to others these are the things i'm going to be highlighting and explaining that i've highlighted as actually in that particular in that particular book and then i have had a lot of people have asked me questions about Oh, and when I want to use an insole, what am I supposed to use? What am I not supposed to use? Literally for me, I think if you are a shoe business owner, the business of shoemaking is a book you should have in your library. Trust me. Especially if you have this global mentality, you have an intention of taking your business from locality to, you know, being global. You have an intention of building a conglomerate from it. You have an intention of actually making whatever you are able to achieve from it transferable to the next generation, to the generation of your children, to the generation, to the next generation. If that's the intention, I think you really need to grab your copy. You can decide to actually order on Amazon and you can also decide to actually order on sale. I have options for you that where you can actually you know get to buy the ebook but it, the amazing thing is that you can invest in my ebook in my book in my book and they regret it <laughs> yes another thing that i also highlight is how you can measure your shoe last so many times people have asked me how do i go about the measurements of my shoe last how do i do this all of these i've explained inside that particular um 
that particular book so i implore you to go get it if you are if you're a beginner i recommend this for you if you're not a beginner you already have experience but you just want to update yourself it's a must have as far as i'm concerned now let me quickly give us a few tips about um the youtube channel yes the gist i was referring to now i find out that most times um when it comes to to our youtube channel so many people have of, of course been asking me have you been paid have you done this have you done that well i would like you to know that the only thing that gets um a monetized youtube channel paid is the fact that you are watching it and not downloading it when you watch it when you like it when you share it those are the things that makes the money and not when you just get there oh yes yes i think i love this you downloaded it and then you think oh the money is all bucked up together and especially in nigeria where our rpm is very low and then you know the click rate too is something else the payment is something else so low you don't want to know how much um, we are being paid for a 1000 views yes your 1000 click and that's even if you even if you go through it at all so I just want us to know that in short it's actually a tedious thing. it's only if you are sent a that's the only thing that will keep you going if you come for the many you might not be able to continue especially if you don't have a way around you know producing your content now after I, I was monetized because normally YouTube will tell you you must have at least 4,000 hours watch people must watch you for at least 4,000 hours within the space of one year because you before you can be monetized as a channel so when it was same um, 4,000 I succeeded in um, you know reaching that 4,000 by the grace of God and by your help you're watching <laughs> I was able to clock that before be, between the space of one year and also the the subscribers must be at least 1,000 subscribers between what within one year which also God helped us to achieve and then after you get of course after that you will be able to monetize your channel so i was eligible i was eligible for monetization which i ended up you know going for fill the form and normally youtube don't pay you directly they pay into your google accents where you actually go ahead and then receive so when you know when youtube you know um notify them of whatever you have made and all that and it's been transferred to you know when it's your adsense account you will not be able to withdraw it until you do some crucial verification and then that took me a lot sometimes they have to suspend my monetization because of all of that so this tip can actually be helping you probably you know somebody doing youtube or having one challenge or the other this might be a good one to share with them as well probably somebody that is just starting and having difficulty feel free to ask me any question under this video and i'll surely answer and if you're just watching my channel for the first time ensure that you subscribe to my channel and then press the notification bell so that each time i share tips like this i do this most time on thursdays on thursdays on my youtube channel so basically you have to go through the process of verification you have to ver verify your address they have to verify who you are and then a lot of verification you have to submit your identity card and i find that so many times so many people have problem with that because by the time you are filling the form on your google adsense you must ensure that the address you're putting on your google adsense must actually be the address on your id card sometimes some people feel a different address on their on their google adsense and then another one on the id card and, and it's another address that's on the id card i find out that google wasn't accepting it that's what i find out it wasn't accepting it the google accents i mean wasn't verifying my you know identity as a result of that so i have to find it you have to ensure that so it's just to let you know that when you want to verify your your identity it's important that now you have an original you are actually scanning an original copy of your identity card that has the same address with the address you feel inside you know the form so watch out for that so whatever kind of identity form of identification you are using international passport probably you are using your driver's license you are using your national id card ensure that the address on your identity card 
or whatever you're using as a mode of identification tallies with whatever you are feeling inside the form as you address so it makes them identify you quite easily that's one then another thing is they want to verify your address they will be sending a code to your address and then that's you're going to be using the code sent to you to actually activate your account for them to be able to pay you so i, I think that was a major challenge for me because i was expecting that okay and um, when it gets to Nigeria, probably um, it will be at our post office and things like that, wherever, where will it be? I was just trying to find out from other people who I know who do YouTube. It seems like they can't, can't even remember how they did. So it's like everyone around seems not to remember how they actually did their own. So I, I just want us to know that when it comes to if you're a Nigerian and you're Probably you have a website, you have a blog, you are having issues with your ads, Google AdSense, because I know that's where all the money enters into Google AdSense. I want you to just, if you need your verification code, go to the post office around you. Let them know the code, whatever code you use as your postcode. Ask them, they will tell you which area you should go to if it's not their own jurisdiction. They will tell you where it is. Just go to wherever they ask you to go. When you get there, tell them you, you came for a Google Accents and code and stamp password and things like that and they will guide you on what to do. So I had to start, start, I started start session. So at the end of the day, I found out that all the old ones, I didn't say mine, it was in the... So when I finished, I told the man I can't find mine, I was already getting bored that they had already suspended my monetization just because I've not been able to do it for a long while. They will give you a date. I think it's almost close to three months as at that time that mine was actually suspended. I know some people have their way of actually collecting their money from Google AdSense without the code. I don't know how. I have had somebody told me that. But I just didn't want to get myself involved in what I don't need. Why do? Why the rush? The rush. I've rushed. I've, I've been doing this thing for how many, how many years and it's not as if I was paid anything. Why the rush? And I'm grateful to God that at least people are blessed doing it. So why do I have to rush myself and how much is even the money? If you are even not careful. It depends on how much people, how, how well people watch your videos and things like that. So, what is now the rush for me? It's not actually the, the big deal. So, I just took my time and then, and I was just free for that day when I got to that place. And then, at the end of the day, they said there were some new one they just brought that probably I should check. When I check, I saw it. I felt like fainting. You know when you have been waiting for something and you are not even sure. Let me tell you something. I find that information is key to everything, and that's what I'm telling you. Sometimes you feel you don't need something, but in the real sense of it, you need it. Like I was talking about my book now, the book, The Business of Shoemaker. I've been doing business now. What do I need it for? Okay. The amazing thing is that you don't know what kind of idea will be will be better by reading the book. You don't know. Just an information is all you need. And you'll be surprised at what level your business will begin to expand and grow. I'm telling you, that was how I, at the end of the day, I just uh, took it right there. Why sitting down there? I used this code and hula my monetization was actually allowed again and I found out that all my videos have been monetized so and I just wanted to know I think after a day after also if I'm very correct I received my first 151 dollars and that's that's for about how many months so I just find out that wow I, I received my I think it should be 151 dollars if I'm correct or 169 I know I, I I received it and then I'm like wow 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 and normally normally you have to reach a particular treasure before they'll be able to pay you you don't say oh this month I made twenty dollar and they will pay you no I think the minimum is about hundred dollar hundred dollar so at, as soon as you reach hundred dollar they will pay you except you set it for them to pay you at five hundred or one thousand dollar on your Google AdSense except that but if not they will always pay you when you have your money come together to about hundred dollar so i just want to encourage somebody i don't know if you would like to do youtube i don't know if you are still thinking about it i don't know if you just started and you're feeling like will i ever achieve this thing i think you should keep on with the content keep on creating the content if you're just starting just keep on creating keep on giving value i found that the reason why i was not really 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 looking at whatever youtube was was going to pay me or paid or hasn't paid me was because i was every of your review every of your comments every of your feedback they always make my day i'm telling you the truth they make my day so for me it's actually a privilege 
to be able to you know impact other people's life now is this you i'm a shoemaker i'm just a beginner but i'm finding it difficult to understand how to create a neat job i'm finding it difficult to actually create patterns i'm also finding it difficult even to understand how to last my designs i can't bottom properly everything seems to be in an improper shape what do i do now i want you to know I know you have a tutor, you have an instructor, you have actually paid somebody to do this for you. But it seems not to be giving you the best that you actually desire. Now I have opened up this particular exclusive forum for you. It's going to be on WhatsApp. And what do we do? I'll be answering your questions. You'll be having access to my exclusive videos from my YouTube channel. When I mean exclusive videos, what, I, what do I mean? Anytime I create a particular pattern, you have access to the PDF file. And also have access to how I created the upper and how I finally finished the product as long as it is not published on my YouTube channel. You have the chance to dictate what you would like me to actually put up on my YouTube channel. This is what I am going to be doing for you this year. It's always a privilege. I'm just a vessel and I'm grateful to God. So please, whatever, whatever you are doing, just keep on doing it. When it seems like, oh, there is nothing happening, I want you to know that it could be your processing period i'm still on that process god is still processing me so are you also going on that process so just wait keep doing it and trusting god for help daily trusting god for help you don't want to know what happens to me sometimes when i want to upload because you don't know when you make a profit making business making shoes and you use it to upload a video and it's go on and on and on and it's not as if there's a returns and i have found out that one way or the other god has been helping me he makes provision for data and in nigeria data is hot kick i mean hot kick hot kick you understand so i just want to appreciate you once again now if you're watching my channel for the first time ensure you subscribe to my channel and press the notification bell make sure that you share this particular video like it let me have your comments it's always dear to my heart i see some people comment and delete it i don't know why but it always makes my heart bleed because sometimes i end up seeing what you wrote what you wrote i see them so i'm like why is she deleting it why is he deleting it Thank you for being part of today's talk show. Don't forget to order for the book. I will leave the link in the description. Thank you once again. And God bless you. Bye. Hi everyone. And I still remain your show. Making made easy to talk. Odu Role Mojibola. Yes, today I came because of you. Yes, you. Yes, I mean you. I remembered very well you came to my DM and you were telling me, oh, I love the way you teach on YouTube. You are just my mentor. Thank you so much. And I'm like, wow, really? I'm your mentor. Oh, God. Praise God. And now you add that I just published a book on the business of shoemaking and you have not ordered your own. I am not your mentor. I am not your mentor. If I am your mentor, go and order. Read the book. Put your review there. Then you have a license to call me your mentor. Yes, I mean it. And I still remain your shoe making made easy to talk. Oduruli Mojibola. The link is inside my, it's in my bow. Just get, just, just get a click and you have access to the link and make your order. Yes, on Amazon is right there. Make your order. If you have any issues with the payments, please let me know and I will put you through. Yeah.